sparred with uh, I sparred with Sean Strickland. Tell us how it Did went. Tell honest, you about that? honest. Don't lie to us. Tell us. Okay, I'll tell you how it went. So first off, anytime I go to a new gym, they try. There's always one dude that tries to knock me out, especially if they find out who I am. They're like, "Ain't you the dude? <laughs> if I knock him out, I'll be like, I, you know." Um, so I went. So I used to go to that gym all the time. Extreme Couture. I used to go to that gym. I love that gym. That gym is. Have you been there? Yeah, of course, bro. I love that gym. It's it's an amazing. The coach Eric, he's awesome. Um, but I used to go there all the time. So I was in Vegas. So I hit up my uh, my boy. I was like, hey, man, you know, uh, Sydney, right? He's part of the amateur team. I was like, I know y'all do like amateur sparring on Saturday. What time is it? Because like, oh, we're doing boxing at one. I was like, cool. So I show up at one o'clock and uh, I don't see any amateurs. I was like, where the amateurs at? And so I went to the back. <laughs> I see, you know, two cages and he putting on like hand wraps. And then next to him is is Chris Curtis, right? I already <laughs> know Chris as far Yeah, you. I already know. Chris, Chris, you see, you know, you know Chris what? I know. He I know he you. sparred with you. Oh no, he didn't. Oh, did he not? He didn't. Okay. He didn't. Yeah, he didn't spar with me. I tried to. Anyway, so I it was Chris Curtis. It was a couple of UFC uh, other UFC fighters. Then it was Sean Strickland, and uh, Sean. You know, Sean's a psycho. I didn't. That man's a psycho, bro. That dude is a psycho. <laughs> I mean, in an interview, he was like, "If I went to an MMA fight, I'd be a serial killer." And I remember, <laughs> I remember people laughing, and I was like, "That's not funny, bro." <laughs> like he just, they was like, "What do you think about?" He's like, "Murder." They're like, <laughs> "I'm like, bro." He just said he thought about murdering people, and uh, so I was like, "So my first mistake, I had a vegan shirt on." So, oh my God. Uh, <laughs> Sean oh. walks over. He goes, "He goes, you know how to fight?" And I was like, "Yeah, a little bit." And he goes, "But your shirt?" And I was like, "I don't know what that means." And Sean walks back to his friends, goes, some gay guy is trying to fight us. And I was like, okay. <laughs> oh, my I'm, God. I said, I'm vegan, not gay. That's what I said. I said <laughs> okay, man. Well, never heard that joke before. So I get in the ring. It's 10 of us. And uh, it's like 10 of us. So it groups of two. So you're like, there's one dude who's like teaching the class who's just beating up everybody. He's massive. That's what I they do at, at, at Fusion. Oh, Shout out to Julian Williams. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I want my rematch, Julian. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you sparring Julian? Fuck me up. Man. Oh, my God. He always do that. <laughs> he waited he wait until after I sparred six rounds. As soon oh. as I sat down, like, God He dude. always He's called like, on, me man. first. He'd be like, hey, come on over. Um, So I'm sparring. You know, I spar uh, uh, um, on my boy. I know, you know, I'm like, oh, he got better. You know, I spar with someone else. And then I try to go with Chris. I was like, hey, Chris, man, you got a partner? He goes, I don't know, man. You seem, that's how you say it. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, I don't know, man. You seem kind of new. Like he's, if he, if I talk to him on the phone, I mean, bro, he, Chris, Chris, Chris's voice sounds like he's a really good dancer. You know, like so, 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 so he said he didn't want to go with me, but I really want to go. I love his style. Like I love how he's left handed, and I like his Philly. Sh like I love his style, and he's a boxing heavy. So I was, I wanted to really, but you I wanted I, to kick him in the head, nigga. You, you kick a lot. <laughs> he does a lot of Philly show. Yeah, yeah. You were like, oh, I probably can kick. This guy in the head. But when I seen them, like when I seen when I seen uh Chris, when I seen like Sean, they didn't seem like as big as they seem on like TV. They just don't seem like everyone, everyone I ever meet has looked smaller and when people meet me, they're like, Oh, you look smaller, you look bigger on TV. People always say that. The only person I ever seen that looked bigger in person is Francis and Ghana. Yep. That's the only person you seen him in person? Yep. Bruh. Yeah. I was like, bro, Intimidatingly he looks large massive. Yeah. yeah, but when I, Sean Strick, he just seemed like he was like around maybe five pounds heavier than me. Like he didn't seem, I was I was pretty, I was about 205 at the time and he was cutting down. Anyway, so he's like, I'll go with the new guy. That's what he said. Because Chris was like, I don't want to go. And he's like, I'll go with the new guy. And I was like, that doesn't sound safe, but I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it. So I'm like, cool. I know Sean, he crazy. He probably going to go super light in the beginning, then try to knock me out towards the end of the round. And I was wrong. This dude tried to knock me out immediately. Oh as soon yeah. as the bell rang, he was, wow, wow. He was just throwing these body shots. And it, it, it was like, uh, I know people think I can't fight because I'm ticklish. But let me just say, <laughs> let me just say, I don't want to, no one wants to be tickled in any way. So me, I'm for real. Like, I, I, I no one's like, get in here. You know, like, so, <laughs> so I think, I, I'm not even making this up. I think me being ticklish makes my reflexes better. And so I feel like I was actually, I was blocking. I was, bro, I was blocking a lot of shots. He was, he tried to hit me to the body and he was trying to hit me hard. And I remember him hitting me and I was like, none of this hurts. <laughs> I remember thinking that. Sean, you will be, he will beat me up in a fight. Am I saying I could beat him up? Am I saying he was trying his hardest? I'm not saying that. All I'm saying is whatever he was doing, it just wasn't working. It wasn't working. <laughs> it wasn't working. It, wasn't working, it was so not simply. working. And I was like, oh man, this, I, I've been, I, I just like, I was like, oh man, I'm blocking a lot of these shots. And I was like, man, I'm feeling real. Poof. And I go flying. 
across the ring. I was like, what hit me? I, it was like it was like a flash. I was like, what hit me? That was crazy. I ran back to get back. I was like, okay, I don't know what hit me, but I'm going to keep Poof, It's the second time. He's punched me in the back of the head. Oh, that was he's the white power me, that hit you, buddy. He's punched me in the back of the head. So I, I said, Sean, I know you think I'm a comedian, but if you punch me in the back of the head, I'm, you ain't going to make it out of this ring alive. Now nah, I didn't say that out loud, but like he knew, <laughs> bro. He could tell what I was thinking when I was crying, and so I, I told him, "Just don't do it again." So I'm like, I'm like, uh, cause I wanted, to, I was anybody else, I would have said something to, but then I, I started to say something, but I was like, I probably shouldn't say nothing because he's hit me in the back of the head, and he happy. What if he get mad? So I was like, whatever. So I go again, third time, poof, he hits me in the back of the head. I go flying across the ring. So I'm like, hey man, that's the third. This is my say something out loud. I said, this is the third time you hit me in the back of the head. He goes, yeah. I was like, why you keep hitting me back of the head? He goes, because you keep ducking. And I was like, well, I'm, I'm ducking so you don't hit me in the front of the head. And he goes, yeah, you got to stop doing that. <laughs> what? I was like, what? That's I was a, like, what? That's the second time I heard then, something like that. Then bro. the bell, oh, work? Yeah. And then the bell rang, and then he was like, that was a good round. We got to do that again. I said, no, we don't. <laughs> no, we don't have to do it. I'm a comedian, bro. Knock, knock. Who's there? Not me. I'm gone, bro. <laughs> I'm not about to stick around. You hit me in the back of the head. That's crazy, man. That is Because I don't crazy. have no, no, what's the defense for There's that? There's none. Yeah. You know, so like, I mean, I thought that was like, I thought that was wild. And then I was, for him to admit it. And then afterwards, I was just like happy I got to spar with him. And then uh, he was, I was like, hey, man, uh, great spar. He's like, yeah, man, if I'd have had a hand wrap, I would have really dug into the back of your head. That's what he said. <laughs> He's like, I would have really dug into the back of your head, but I, I hurt my hand. <laughs> I was like, what? Yeah, that is crazy. Yeah. Um, yeah, once we found out like the medulla oblongata is back there and you could die, we yeah. kind of made that illegal in fighting. That's what I'm saying. That is crazy. That's what I'm saying because <laughs> I see him in interviews and he's talking about other fighters should be like kicked out because yeah. you know they're doing steroids and those people that are doing steroids, you're in a sport of fighting, you could really hurt somebody. And I'm bro, I'm telling you, three days afterwards, I think I got a concussion, bro. I like I felt like dizzy. My wow. head was ringing, bro. I've never been like dropped from a punch. I mean, I, the only time I've been dropped is someone teed me to the body. And then I, I was like, who? Black Lives Matter. You know, but I just, the only time, that's the only time I've ever been like, I, I've never been like, like, super, yo, I have really good training partners. Yo, shout out to Sean, but we will jump you, dog. <laughs> Immediately. We Immediately. Will, uh, we will jump you, bro. man. That's like, the, that's we, will but, jump you. <laughs> but, we will jump you. We will jump you. 100% we will jump you. You like wilding out on the homies, but I just Black barred Bell. Sean like two weeks ago oh, and okay. we went five rounds. Um, and I did extremely well, but in the fourth round, <laughs> Sean was like, yo man, um, you gotta move more, you know? And like, I gotta respect you, you know? So like, I could do this all day. Like, you know, like I spar big guys and you know, but you gotta move more and um, kick, you know? And then I started moving, he started walking me down to beat me up. <laughs> what I was doing was effective. Yeah, it's very yeah, effective. Yeah. I've been sparring Mike a long time. Like pressure fighters, you have to meet their pressure. Yeah, with yeah. Pre you have to meet their aggression with aggression. You yeah. can't tiptoe around. I, You're yeah. gonna get more tired circling around a guy like Sean or Mike Perry. They're gonna walk you down, and eventually you're gonna get tired. Yeah. I.e., him versus Izzy. Izzy is a, a he faints, faints, react. He's not really a combo type guy. He's a counter puncher. Yeah. Faint distance. So with Sean's style, it makes it very hard for a guy like Izzy. You got to meet him. I met him. Three rounds. That's what I did. And I kept catching. He took me down in two rounds. The first round he took me down, held me down. Hard for me to get up. Second round took me down again. No striking, no crazy fighting. I'm eating to the wrestling. Third round, did great. Uh, fourth round was around. He was like, yo, man, if you can. Then I got punched on that round because I'm backing him. He's walking me down. He's big. Pause, hitting me, boom, boom, boom. And then the fifth round. So it was good, but. What happened in the fifth round? I did well. I, I thought well. that's what happened. I did well. I thought but, that's what may happen. That's what I did. I knew I do the same thing because I'm like I'm not gonna back up. So no. if they, I don't know who recorded it, I'm certain. I'm I'm sure someone recorded, recorded it. it. Yeah. Well, if they if you look at the recording, whatever they show, I don't back up. That's how you win. Yeah, I wasn't like backing that's, up, and it was like I just don't understand. He was like throwing. I don't understand why he was throwing haymakers to back my head. So not to get too like deep into the MMA and shit, but there's a a stat I can't. I'm not going to be able to like cite it. But there's a stat that says in most MMA fights, the person who goes forward wins, wins the fight. It's not like that in boxing. It's not like that. And yo, shout so. out to yo, clap it up for the random stats of Oxley. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, that's like the meta game. It's like the meta Yo, game. Paul, we got to think of, we got to have something for that. Oh, I already got one. I was what? already thinking of the last one he had in the where he's like, blind people are more successful than deaf people. <laughs> that shit was crazy. <laughs> Can we interview <laughs> Preacher Lawson? You guys are so disrespectful. <laughs> this whole podcast has been an attack on my character. That shit is, is that true, though? I forgot. He said that. He said oh, it. okay. It's true. <laughs> it's really weird, bro. <laughs> I don't know where that's that. I'm just saying, blind Yo. people more. That I mean, successful deaf people, do you know? Man. <laughs> Just think off the top of your head. I guess, you know, um, how many successful deaf people? Oh, that's crazy, bro. How many successful what? blind people do you know? Yeah, a few of them. Uh, but I rest my motherfucking case. Yeah. I rest my case. <laughs> case rested. Oh, so he just made that up. Get yes. my, somebody <laughs> put my case in the it's bed. It's weird because he's still warm. <laughs> <laughs> Can somebody tuck my case in because it's resting right now, buddy. All right, oh, but yeah. Um, Sean Strickland is... Insane. And um, so there was the fight that he had with that one. I can't remember his name. He just died like two years ago. And the dude like died. tweaked it. He, yeah, he passed away. Uh, RIP him. I don't From remember the his UFC? name. No, he's, but he was an old school MMA fighter. Like, type, like, oh, no way. You, it was bald and big. I know you're talking about he was a jujitsu guy. Yeah. And his, his name was Orlando. Oh, I don't know. No, that's his name. His name was Orlando. White dude? It was a white dude that was, he was, he like cranked his arm. Yes. And then Deshaun was like, dude, hey, dude, come, hey, on, dude, oh, dude, come, come on, dude, dude, come on, bro. Yeah, left yeah, the yeah. Ring. Come on, man. Yeah, Orlando Sanchez. And then left Sanchez. the ring. Yeah, Orlando Left Sanchez. the ring after yeah, that. Yeah, 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 they yeah. should have rumbled right there, 100%. I didn't get that. It's like, bro, I'll just fucking do the, I'll do some fucking yeah, MMA. Yeah, I remember thinking that. Remember no, they should have rumbled 100%. And he bounced. But then you punch a preacher loss in the back of the head. No. Uh, I'm just saying. Valid. Uh, yeah, they should have, look, because like you saying, I don't know if it's how we grew up. I'm not assessing size, pause. Stature when bro, when I when I'm red every five <laughs> seconds. Yo, that bro. is crazy. Just let it play. That it he's that from is New York. Crazy. Let it play, bro. He's from New York. You should have seen when no, no, no. Was right here. I'm let it play, baby. Funny. That is a cr- something let crazy play. to say. <laughs> Can't like, stop, won't stop. I no, am no. not <laughs> assessing size. Like that's crazy. But like, um, Paul and, is a comma and, in New York, man. And, and that's like, <laughs> and that's like, been detrimental to me over the course of my life. You know what I'm saying, like. When that switch go, I'm I'm rumbling. So like you saying, like there's no if ands or buts. Rest in peace. They should have rumbled right there. Period. Yeah, I mean like it's it's ingrained in me. Has that ever happened to you where you like you're training with someone, they do something dirty, and then you like all right. Yeah, I mean we talking about it. Fuck it. Um, so there's this one cat in my gym. I'm not gonna say his name. Good dude. Um, big guy, wrestler. I don't know why. You, I know you get this uh, in your respected field because I get it in mine. Pause. People, that's crazy. Pause. Now, see, that's pause. <laughs> that's crazy. I definitely deserve this, man. <laughs> that is There's no argument. I against feel me. like this is more gay. <laughs> no, <it's not. laughs> Anytime you pause, bro, because I'm not even thinking about it. And then you say pause, and I'm you like, oh, you, that is. You get it in your field. I, bro, I don't even think about it. And now, I get I, it in mine? Yeah. That's, look at that. I get that's it in crazy. mine. Yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Crazy. But that is, wow. Um, <laughs> people want to fight me and they don't it's just oh you're a fighter man oh do you think i'm like bro chill man like i'm not i don't get in street fights yeah. anymore like that's been i'm 33 that was i was a kid yeah chill i don't want to fight you it happens to me i'm not even a fighter but you know what i'm saying so you know people come up to me and like want to shadow box and do all kind of dumb shit and like that's not the type of time they'll see me and paul in there hitting the pads hey you, you guys want to want to spar no, I don't know you. I don't really want to spar, but then I fuck him up real quick. But yeah. you know what I'm saying? And like, who were we? Who was the story we were talking about? Um, we were talking about Orlando and Sean. What's Orlando? Sean Orlando Sanchez. Sanchez that passed away. Yeah. Um, the guy at the gym was a big guy. Was a heavyweight. Guy at the gym, big guy, heavyweight wrestler. So we're out at uh, at a local event, <laughs> and um, after the event, I'm leaving. And the gym is in front of the establishment that the event was at, the fights. And he is charged up, drunk, amateur, uh, like a blue belt. He wrestled in college. Ah, motherfucker, big brolic dude. Maybe like 220, like this. And he's like, yo, Phil, I could take you down. I was like, oh, probably not, but I guess. That's how the beef between John Jones and um, D- Daniel see, Cormier yeah. started. Yeah. It was odd, though. Because I'm like, respectfully, in this field, I am here. You don't exist. It's just a fact. I'm not. 
This is how it is. <laughs> it's just a fact. You don't even fight. You're a. You don't even fight. You're aspiring to fight. So he was in the front around a group of people. A lot of them are friends. And he was like, yo, fuck, I can take you down. And then it was funny. And then I'm laughing. I'm like, no, probably not. Blah, blah, blah. Then he's like, no, 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 no. Then he started getting like aggressive. And it was weird. And there's like girls around people. We're all dressed up nice. And he's like, no, no, no. I'm telling you. Then he dressed started getting- Dressed up nice. Where's this at? We're at a, uh, a local regional fight. Okay. And But everybody's like, you know, got jewelry on, dressed. You know what I'm saying? Like girls wearing dresses, heels. And he's very aggressive. It's not like joking. And it's weird. It's a weird angle. I'm like, where is this coming from? Like, I'll beat the back teeth out of your mouth, bro. Yeah. You crazy? Like, what are you, what are you doing? Yeah. So he's, he's keeping it going. Then I'm just like, bro, what are we even, like, you don't exist in my world. Like, what is happening, man? This is weird. You know me. You're my boy. I never sh shun nobody. So I don't know if it's like you people around you like, yo, Phil, I'm showing you love anyway. It was really weird. We get back to the gym. I see him. I'm like, yo. Put your mouthpiece in. Let's go. We have to. Like, what were yeah. you doing the other night? <laughs> Big dude. Oh, it was a little weird. No, no, no. Let's go. What did you say? <laughs> so we're going to the, we're going to the mats. We go on the mats. He's a wrestler. He did this in college. I poke, bro. What are you doing? The fuck, man. Mind you, I just had the uh, the laser surgery. Kind of crazy. I'm like, yo, bro, chill out. I'm like pissed off a little bit. That's Reset. why you brought up Kim Kardashian. Reset. Like, Went again. Laser surgery. In the we're, eye. Pause. We're wrestling. <laughs> You're getting it. You're getting it. We're wrestling again. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting it. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. Whoa. Pokes my eye again. Whoa. Back to back. I'm tight. Yo, what the? Bing. Bare fist. Hey, Phil, chill, something. <laughs> Stop, man. What are you doing? <laughs> I felt mad. You know what I'm saying? I went, made a big apology, but Stay cold. in my defense, I went online. And in my defense, I had to get my eye re-lasered because of that. Oh, really? oh, damn. This is my livelihood, homie. You know what I'm saying? It you all go blind. And, you, and it all Based started, on that fact, you you could have hit him three more times. I should have yeah. wild, I should have wild At least. out. And it went, and it started with what? You for whatever reason, being around people like, yo, Phil, yeah, you do know me. We're we're homies. Like, why are we doing this here? So I, I run into that sometimes now, but I'm way in a different space. You know what I'm saying? I know how to Imagine, that. like, you are a UFC fighter. I don't Were you a UFC fighter at the time? This was four months ago. Oh, shit. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, I was pissed. So he's messing up the money. Exactly. And, that could have stopped and, and, the and fight. I, and thank God. I didn't, you know what I'm saying? Like, people, I, I ain't even talking I about mean, it. Oh, no. Nah, bare hand is wild. In the gym. Stupid camera. Yeah. Wow. What the fuck you doing? <laughs> yeah, nah. I think, I don't think you guys asked what, enough. I was, and then everyone's like, yo, Phil, Phil. I'm like, why is it always that? And I told Julian, I said, look, I literally showed him me the, the damage to my eye. He's like, ah, oh, damn. All right, valid. Right? At he that point. Goofy ass down. But we're cool. All love. But that incident was a whole ass incident that happened. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, something like something like I remember I was sparring with a, a dude at a, my uh, one of my first gyms, and then I remember when he first signed up. I remember when he first signed up at the gym, and like you know, he was asking me for you know whatever. And I leave, and I come back like years later. I mean, I, I come back, you know, uh, you know, periodically, uh, every, periodically, and then uh, then you know, but I'm never staying. And I came back like two years later, and like he's like got a couple of fights, whatever, and so he's like, he's like, I want to show. Oh, I'm I already sure. know. Yeah, one and, of those. And, and yeah. now you're buzzing out. Yeah. Now you're buzzing. Yeah. Right. Now you now you got the IG following. Yeah, now yeah, you yeah. got this. So he's already and yeah. he knows you prior. Yeah. So he's connected to you, and you're gonna see him and say what up and show love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. get it. Go ahead. So, um, you know, we boxing, and then it, we got boxing. We sparring. So we're doing some, you know, sparring and uh, kickboxing, kickboxing, Muay Thai. Okay. Uh, we're not doing any grappling. He just does. He just just to strike. But he does like a kick or something. I mean, I throw a kick. And I throw it like you know how you like you you flowing. So you just throw it, you know, a slow kick. He catches it, throws it, bow. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, bro, I let you kick. If I threw it full force, you're not catching that kick. So why would you catch it, then come back, you know, but I was, you know, I didn't say all that. I was just kind of like, I was like, hey man, why would you whatever, bro? So he does it again. And I'm like, bro, that's the second time you did that. He was like, Whoa, you you hit me. So I'm just hitting you back, you know? And I was like, okay, all right, bro. You don't got to say anything more. <laughs> you don't say less. So I was just like, he kind of, 
you kind of know when you spar someone where you're like, okay, now we're fighting. Yep. And so <laughs> I, I, I threw, you know, I threw a, a couple of shots and I threw a body kick that just landed because he was like southpaw. And I just, he was southpaw and I was orthodox and I just took my right, bow, and you could hear it. And then he spits his mouthpiece out. Let's go. And I'm like, well, put it back in. <laughs> <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? We got all the safety precautions right here. You put out, put them out, and then we'll go again. He was like, nah, man. I'm from the streets. He kept telling me that. And I'm like, but I'm black, bro. That's not going to work on me. <laughs> You're from the streets. Which one? <laughs> Which street? That matters a lot. A so, lot. Like, a lot. Facts. You know? I'm also from me, a street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That matters. That matters a lot. Man. You, does your street have Trader Joe's on it? Because then I'm not scared. <laughs> like, just, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, they were also on streets. You know, like, yeah. Yeah, bro. Come on, man. So I remember, so he started going, he started just going off or whatever. And, uh, and you know, just start, I don't know, he just, he just started flipping out. But I was like, bro, like, it's not that serious. You hit me hard. I hit you hard back. If you don't want to be hit anymore. Stop hitting like, me. Bro, just, just stop. Just you, you hit me light back, then I'll get it. You hit me super light, and I'm like, okay, that's what we're doing. I just match whatever you give me, and um, and so he was just going off, and I was like, this is stupid. So I was just like, hey man, I apologize for like, and he was Cole. not, he was not trying to, yeah, Jake. I was, I was trying to apologize. He wasn't trying to hear, it. and then he just was going off. So I ain't talked to this dude for months, not months, probably like almost a year. And then I seen him the other day at the gym, and we made eye contact. And I was like, and he did it back. And I was like, dang, I ain't mean to do that. <laughs> you know, you know how like you see somebody. <laughs> That's a fight. You forgot you, you know, I, didn't mean, I didn't mean to say what's you up. Forgot you was bro, mad. I was like, I forgot I hate you, bro. And I just, it was too late. I already said what's up. He said what's up. And then we seen each other. It was like, how you been? I'm good, man. How you been? And we just was cool. Then I realized I was like, what we were fighting about was so dumb. Jim in LA. It was in LA. Okay. It was in LA. Yeah, yeah. I'm a one more, one more, uh, and I'm, I'm gonna get off MMA because you got a lot going on, and I want to highlight that. Okay, cool. Um, you had a fight in Orlando. I got the corner you at. That was so dope. Uh, I forget what this was, but it was a it was a kickboxing tournament. Yeah. And preacher won, but we got disqualified somehow because the dude got knocked out. Yes, nigga, that's that's why we're there. <laughs> but, <laughs> so apparently, it's like uh, somebody was talking trash the whole time. It was time, amazing. Bro. I love it. Was it. Hilarious. I I I enjoyed that day more than I've enjoyed some fight nights in the UFC. <laughs> so it's like a uh, it's, it's different when you when you really uh, really know international like, kickboxing. It's like that, but it was like uh, it was. They said not, no. It wasn't point. No, but, no, it's continuous. But I get, it's like. It's not full content. But, yes, but there were good guys there. So it's right? the, the Pussy Luminous League nah, and shit. Like nah, because, that. nah, because there's, <laughs> there's, there's skill guys there for sure. But just the art of it is it's full kickboxing, right? Head kicks, everything. But you're, you're supposed to control. But these guys are still good. So there's, it's supposed to be sparring. Yes, yeah. sparring, but sp sparring gets aggressive, right? Yeah, and you can't reel off a combo. No, okay, I get it. I get so, it. So, I think you had four fights that day, maybe five. Uh, I had, I had four. Yeah, four. Four I, to no, win. Wait, I think I had three because I had the first guy, and then no, wait, did I have two? No, it was more than two. Yeah, I thought it was. It, more. was, it was three or four fights to win, but we won. We didn't, but we clearly won. So. <laughs> Uh, and the commission knows me. So this is the commission. Oh, does he? Yeah, they know me. That's you the reason I got disqualified. <laughs> no, nigga, you, you knocked them out. <laughs> so we're the first match, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Throughout the whole event, one of the commissions saw me, so he kept, like, enforcing the rules on Preacher. Yo, uh, he, watch that. Ease up. But, yo, we still got to fight. You know, and and still, this is his first competition at this point. So whatever the skill set is, this is his first competition. So we're here accordingly. He just kept giving him warnings. Yo, uh, hey, man, watch that. But we still got to fight. Fast forward, we end up in the finals. And I saw the guy that we were going to fight, and he was doing well. And they he got in a fight the match before yeah. I watched him. They were yeah, fighting. They were, they were fighting. They were fighting. Fighting. And I don't see the issue. So he made it to the finals, him and Preacher going at it. Mind you, I'm heckling everybody this whole day. <laughs> like, just Get heckling. Get that belt ready for us. <laughs> heckling, talking shit. Yeah. And so during the finals, 
They're going, they're going. And mind you, I have it on my phone. It's hilarious. I'm going to repost this after this. Um, but the guy keeps, hey, watch that. Watch that. And new, throughout the day, he's getting warnings. Right hand, flatlines the guy, knocks him out. I'm, yeah, like, we won. He goes, yeah, you're disqualified. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that's the very next <laughs> and thing. And you're disqualified. <laughs> so they're fighting, bro. They're literally fighting. Preacher slips. Bing, hits him with a right. Guy's out. This is like in the second round. Fight's over. He's on the ground. They was like, dude, what the hell? They're fighting, though. And this guy knows how to fight. And he's like, got a nosebleed already. Boom. And immediately, all you hear is, yeah, you just got disqualified. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> epic. And, like, that post actually went it went ham on my page. But, um, yeah, he won, he won the tournament. But I even told him, I was like, yo, bro, I get you're an amateur, but, like, you got to fight if you're going to fight because this shit is, like, yeah, it's, yeah. it's unfair. So, side note, celebrity boxing, I'm his manager. Uh... Logan Paul, Deron Williams, y'all getting washed. So if there's any he said celebrity, he said Van Lathan, yo. if there's any celebrity, but Van hasn't fought yet. If there's any celebrity boxing match, let's get Preacher Lawson. I'll co-sign it. Logan, um, who was all these other guys that the the celebrity guys <clears> that are doing these? Uh, KSI. KSI get washed. Washed. Send the contract. He a comedian. What are we talking about? I'm down. I get that why y'all said it was it was probably more fun than the UFC fights. Bro, it's something it about, was hilarious. It was epic. I loved that whole day. It's something about I okay. So I told y'all I've been sparring Paul every day since 2005. I just I know everything he's capable of. I never think he's gonna lose. I don't care who you put. You could put in Ghana and I was like, yep, Paul gonna do the jump back kick and spin three times <laughs> in the air, nigga. It's gonna be it for it. Ghana ain't never seen no shit like that. Like, I just always think he's gonna win. So every time we went to like uh the fucking Kumbate, whatever it's called, the Kumbate. I was just like, yep, Fact. can't wait. Just standing there like, can't wait for this nigga to knock this nigga the fuck out. It's a lot of fun, them, them amateur joints, man. Bro, that and uh, this amateur event I went to West Virginia, the best events I've ever been to in my life. That was probably first, then that one. That was fun. Yeah. But I might be getting to that because that's, that's hilarious, but that's going to be another whole other half hour. I got more stuff I got to ask. Preacher lost. Yeah, 